so much drama. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the unofficial band head where I am your host, Orlando J, and I have new shindigs. Yeah, I have new shindigs. Yo, thank you for everyone that has subscribed while I was on my break. As you guys know, I always take breaks. I, I am a balanced man. I believe in family, fun, and marching bands and football. That's the things that I love the most. So, therefore, we have some work to get into. Now, I am not reacting to a full battle today, but I am going to react to a comparative study so I can get my feet wet back in the band world. You know what I'm saying? And what better way than to get started with Jackson State and Southern University? In my opinion, this battle took place way too soon. Unfortunately, this was this was too early. Too early for the boombox. Uh, but nevertheless, we had it. So we're going to react to Jackson State versus Southern University, a comparative study, thank God, by Travis Scott. Let's get to work. All right, shout out to March and Sport for the content. Really appreciate it. Uh, if you haven't done so yet, make sure you go over to March and Sport and you subscribe ASAP. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Jackson up first. Uh, they have a very uh, heavy lower brass sound, very penetrating. I know what the strength of that band is this year. Okay, nice walk up. Alright, so from what I can hear already, Jackson State has a very like um very deep dark sound this year. Um heavy on the lower brass. Lower brass seem to be the strongest aspect of the band this year. Definitely trying to be some bullies this year, you know what I'm saying? Coming through trying to bully people, but again, we arrange according to the strength of our bands, and it doesn't sound like the trumpets section is as strong as it was last year. So yeah, I'm interested to see how Southern is going to sound uh, on this song. So, yeah, let's get it. Hey, big. Uh. 
Alright. They definitely got the crowd behind them for sure. They home. <laughs> they getting on. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's talk about it really quick. So first of all, shout out to both bands. I I have to be honest, full transparency, I did watch the fifth quarter between the two of these bands, and I wasn't really that impressed overall with, not with the, the, the song selection, the execution of Southern University. Well, not with the execution of Southern University, but the song selection. But I understand why they were doing what they were doing because apparently Jackson State is more heavy. Uh, they have a much more darker sound, which means they're, they're lower brass, you know, the, the UFOs and um, trombones. You know, they kind of carry the band this year. So therefore, as far as the, the color and the creativity at the top, sometimes lacks so you know you can tell some of their arrangements are a little bit they're not as creative as they were last year however with southern university they have room to create and you can definitely hear the color and uh, at the top of the notes you can hear uh the arrangements and how they're arranging that song from jackson state because it was it has more of a darker sound um it was geared for more power however because southern university apparently have a little bit more of a balanced sound they were trying to really out ballard or out you know they were trying to out i want to say outplay them but you know they were trying to choose songs where there there was complexity in the arrangement which would have to force them to ha have to actually play up um a little bit or choose songs that that had more color and jackson state just wasn't doing that they were sticking to their guns which some people were saying they were getting bored with the selection that southern university was choosing however i personally enjoyed what southern did this song to me uh i have to give it to southern they sounded way better way more mature overall as far as the intonation the color the 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 timbre within their within their music the musicality in this song was overall better and i understand why dr taylor went after jackson state the way that he did with the types of songs that they were selecting instead of just choosing rap song after rap song um to actually battle back and forth with them and get into like this power battle it really wouldn't have mattered so you wanted to to, to actually show something unique in their in their sound right that a lot of people are actually kind of not appreciating what southern is doing you know with their sound over the years you know they've actually really changed a lot um i feel like uh, same thing with jackson state you know but this year they're kind of they're not as bright up top as they as they were you know i could definitely tell they're younger in the trumpet section you know but anyways this has been your boy the fisher bandhead thank you so much for tuning in i really appreciate the love guys and i'm back i can't wait to do the next reaction stay tuned it's coming up peace grand love and i'm out of here oh one other thing i hope you guys like the studio because i have a little something new going on here so all right guys i'm out